Welcome back to the EU4 campaign in which I have to say yes to every single thing. Peace deals, alliances, events, national decisions, it doesn't really matter. And if there is an option to say yes, then I will. Alright, now let's move on to our campaign. Last time we had to flip Shia, nevertheless somehow we managed to ally the Timurids and the Ottomans, so we are doing pretty good. By the way, you can check out the first episode clicking here. Okay, so first of all I probably should deal with this rebel stuff. There is no yes option and I want to deal with my corruption, so let's move towards legalism. Here goes another military tech. We are doing great. Perhaps we are even the first in the world. Look at that, we have overtaken the Ottomans. And while I'm boasting about my military tech, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy my videos. I appreciate it. I'm almost done with my rebels and my manpower is still good. So maybe we'll fight someone soon. Alright, the game wants to decrease my stability. Yeah. I don't need any money. I've never ever had this much corruption from unbalanced research, bro, what is that? Okay, that wasn't quite the plan, but it shouldn't be a big problem with the Ottomans on my side, right? And I don't have any other options anyway. How the hell did they manage to siege it down already? The war's been going for like two months or so, that's insane. Yeah, I'm not surprised at all, of course they came here. Don't get me wrong, this would have been completely fine if I started this war knowing that I'll get something in the end. But this way it's just pure pain. Oh my god, what are you doing? Why are they chilling right here? My country is dying, literally. Alright, I guess I have to do this myself. Yeah, so can you remind me why do I even need these alliances? Okay, I guess they have heard my complaints, that's good. By the way, I also have these guys around my nation. The Ottomans are finally doing their job, which is being the Ottomans. Oh, <laughs> I'd like to pick this option just for fun. Oh, wow, what's wrong with me? Look at this. Wow, amazing. I don't know why did I do this, but I just find it really funny for some reason. Huh, look at that, the Mamluks are literally fighting my rebels. Bro, what a legend, they are doing it again. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, the fifth admin tech in 1493. I don't understand this, why is my enemy helping me more than my ally? Um, it's over, okay. Did I get anything? No, of course not, I don't, I don't need anything, sure. Well, anyways, <laughs> let's look at the bright side. The Mamluks have dealt with most of my rebels. Oh my god, these bastards are unbearable. This is ridiculous. My country has just got devastated because of them, and now they are asking for money. Wow. My claim on Davasir is going to expire real soon, so I'm going for this war right now. Alright, that's better. Alright, now let's do the same thing, but with Ethiopia. Yes, I agree with this event, it's our duty to spend a shit ton of money. Welcome again, shady people. Where have you been? Nobles demand something, I don't care. But I do care about that. <sighs> and I really needed it. Damn, I'm really enjoying these little wars. I'm going for another one. I know it shouldn't be a big deal, but if they will send me a peace deal for money or something like that, it will destroy me. Oh, thanks God. Alright, let's piss out Vileta and let's piss out Simeon. Alright, now my mood is pretty much saved and I can continue playing. I think now I'm going to develop my gold mines and deal with my rebels. Now this is what I like to see. Mm, this guy has allied the Mamluks. Well, that's unfortunate because I wanted to fight him, but I guess not yet. You already know what I'm going to pick here. Yes. Actually, it was fine. We only need to click this button now, and crownlands are good, and we have some extra money. By the way, it turns out that the Mamluks have broken their alliance with Ajuran, so I'm going to attack them next. But at first, of course, I have to deal with my rebels. Ooh, a good event without any downsides. Man, that feels great. Give me that money. Bro, what? What? What do you mean? What is... Better Israel separatists. <laughs> oh my god. Please, I'm dying. That's not the battle we asked for, but it's definitely something we needed. Better Israel separatists versus Giga Chat Yemeni army. 
Okay, that was quick. Alright, rebels are not a big problem now, so we are ready to attack Ajuran. Let's go for it. I have a new ruler and a new heir, and I don't know how to tell you, but you're not going to make it, fella. I don't know where is their army. I've got the 7th admin tag and we are going to pick a new idea group which is going to be religious. Here's another event when we have to support something, alright? And I have to read again. Okay, so Lemma are asking me to pick this option. Still haven't faced the army and the war is over, let's piss them out. I'm also thinking about propagating my religion in Ethiopia, so let's do this. Next, I really want to attack the Mamluks as soon as our true sense. And these guys... These guys just keep robbing me. Do they know something? Why are they asking for things this often, man? Alright, this is why you abdicate. Nice. Alright guys, the truce with the Mamluks has ended, so... Oh my... <laughs> I sincerely believed in them. I mean, I know I should have not. I know. You literally have the biggest income in the world. How do you end up just how do you end up being in a debt of 1100 ducats? That's ridiculous. Oh my god, bro. I I have no comments for that. Please leave a like on this under this video. I need some help to deal with it. Okay, whatever. Let's annex Patero quick. It should lift my mood a little bit. All right, it's tier 4 government reform time and let's go with this one. Damn, Burgundy is alive, independent, they own lowlands, and Castile is their ally. Okay, Pate is occupied, so let's full annex them. Here we go. Alright, this flag has scared me, I'm not going to lie. Of course I'm going to agree, but I'm not sure that you need me. Well, Timurids, are you certain that you need my help in this war? Oh, I see. Right, well, this has a potential to become an endless loop. So, of course, I'm going to click it, but only once. I think that's fair. Oh, wow, it's time for another agency. I love these. It's another year, and here's another estate asking for money. Of course, we have to say yes. Uh, why? I hate this campaign, man. I didn't feel so irritated playing EU4 for, for months. First they get my money and manpower and then they use me in their stupid wars. What a great allies. I swear, if they don't give me anything from this war, I'm breaking the alliance, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I think we should hire some mercs here and I guess a free company will do. Let's go! Eat that! In case if you wonder what the Ottomans were doing during this fight, here they are standing in the middle of the desert. Okay, they gave me some provinces from Hadramut, so I'm not breaking this alliance. Okay, this war is going much better, nevertheless, these guys are a bit of a problem. God damn, we are OP. Alright, looks like we solved the first part of the problem. By the way, my enemies are dealing with my rebels still. Yeah, it looks like the second part of the problem is solved by the Ottomans. Mhm, mm so they've pissed out. Well, as far as I can see, I got two provinces and some money. I guess it could be worse and there is certainly an improvement. Oh, who am I kidding? So much men died for these two stupid provinces in some desert. I'm in pain. Well, on the bright side, I have 100 trust with the Ottomans and I guess we are very good friends now. Okay, now I'm planning to conquer Marihan and Ajuran, though I probably should deal with that for now. Oh, yeah, I completely forgot about that. Well, I guess that changes my plans a little bit. Well, now I kinda regret that the Mamluks won't fight these rebels for me. These casualties are nasty. Okay, can anybody please explain what the hell is happening here? Like seriously, aren't they supposed to hate me more than each other? Why is my army just watching all that? Okay, so I somehow sided with them, and now I lost? What has happened here? Okay, it ended. Wow, what the hell just happened? 
Okay, the rebel issue is solved now, so the worst part is over. Famine strikes Yemen, and we are generous gigachats, so obviously we are going to pick this option. I like how Sweden now is just a part of Finland. Oh yeah, God, thank you for extra stability. Okay, we have a new heir and he's pretty good. And since the disaster is over, let's attack Hajuran. Kilva now owns these two coastal provinces. And that is okay, because I wanted to fight them anyways. Luckily, we are able to phalanx Ajuran. Are you kidding? How did they manage to ally the Mamluks? Okay, so in this case I think it is a pretty good idea to attack Marihan. This war wouldn't be very easy, however, it is definitely winnable. This army right here came from unknown territory, which I cannot explore. This is mildly annoying. Ooh, I completely forgot Hadramut is their ally as well. It won't be hard to deal with them though. Hmm, that's actually unfortunate, because I wanted to full annex these guys. But what are you gonna do? What? How did they manage to siege it down so fast? Not gonna lie, this war with Killa is getting pretty annoying. You know, I don't want them to send me some awful peace deal, so I'd better take these two provinces for now. Alright, we are ready to peace out Marihan now. And oh boy, these are some good looking borders. And now it's even better. So here I'm going to end this video. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. By the way, you can suggest ideas for my next videos in the comments. Thank you for watching and goodbye.